it's Katie Warner, Center Director at Audubon Center for Birds of Prey. And today I'm hosting Lunch and Learn on Audubon's Plants for Birds program. Since we're all together at home, we thought it'd be a great idea to share some easy tips on creating a garden at home. There's so many benefits to starting a garden. You can get outdoors, which helps your physical and mental health. Planting a garden with native plants helps save water. Creating a backyard habitat for birds helps provide important food and shelter for the many migratory birds that pass through our state. Take a quick look at this short video. is it important to plant native? Native plants provide food and shelter for a variety of birds. Did you know that 96% of all North American birds feed their young insects? More insects equals more birds to your yard. Creating a habitat with native plants helps support birds in a changing climate. Also, native plants don't require pesticides or fertilizer, a benefit for your yard and a benefit for your billfold. Some samples of plants in our yard that attract butterflies are pentas and firebush. So there's several species of milkweed in Florida that attract caterpillars. This is the giant milkweed. Caterpillars love this. Remember, the point today is the more insects you can have in your yard, the more birds you can attract. Audubon has many resources to help get you started. To find the Plants for Birds website, simply Google Audubon Plants for Birds, which will take you to our native plants database. You can then type in your zip code or address, which will show you what's available in your area. You can search by ground cover, which will also show you results of birds that would like to those types of plants. So we hope now that you have some additional tools and ideas for starting to create a native garden in your yard. Just start small. You can change a few things at a time. Remember, the more bugs you can host in your yard, the more food you are for providing for our native birds. It's a win-win situation. There are other things you can do in your yard to attract birds in addition to planting native. You can provide a water source, such as a bird bath. You can hang a bird feeder, leave a snag in your yard, and also remember many of our native birds are cavity nesters, so we really recommend not trimming trees during spring. You can create backyard habitat by hanging a nest box, another fun family activity. Remember to take into account the type of trees that you have in your yard also. Trees provide shade and cover and protect birds from predators. You can attract all types of different backyard birds, such as cardinals, hummingbirds, woodpeckers, wrens, catbirds, we just encourage you to get outdoors. Start small and you can create a native garden of your own and learn about plants for birds. Thanks for joining us.